Hey everyone, hope you like this week's video. Stay tuned to learn a little bit more about farming. Right now I got my awesome cousin with me, Emily. You wanna say anything? Hi. She's pretty cool. Right now we are, it's kind of hard to see because of all the mud, but we're using the harrows on one of our fields to kind of get rid of some of the bumps. So I'll show you a little bit of that. Hey everyone, so my cousin just left and I guess I'll show you what this thing looks like. This is mainly used to just kind of take the soil and flatten it out. So when we go across it a billion times when we have to do hay, not actually a billion times, it's about 14 times ish, depending upon the year and what the qual or <clears throat> and the amount of hay we can get off the field. All right, if we can get four crops or not. But this is pretty much used just to make the field smooth. But we are using it right now to get rid of the gopher mounds, gophers are a rodent that digs holes and then makes little um, mounds of dirt over the or on the surface and they eat the roots just a little bit uh, the main problem is just the roughness the eating of the roots is not a major problem for us just because alfalfa roots are really big and doesn't really affect them that much so what i am doing right now i don't know if you've heard this in the news but the Midwest has been getting a lot of, or just got a snowstorm where we live. And that means that the soil is now compacted and I can't really get into the gophers very well. And since this is sandy soil, we can't use a specific tool that needs it to be a little thicker soil. Um, so we pretty much have to go out there with traps and trap each individual one. Um, we know we get a good kill rate on it, it just takes a little bit more time. So I guess this is probably what most of the video is going to be, out, be about this week is trapping gophers and doing this because that's going along with it. So hope you like it. here in the field and I'm going to show you how you find the gopher tunnel. So you're going to push around, try to find where it's soft at. It's kind of soft right here. Try to track it back right here and it's pretty smooth right here. So that means that that's where the tunnel is. You're not hitting a lot of dirt and I'm going to dig it out, find the hole and there it is. Dig this out. it out and then I have the trap right here and over here I'll set it and put it in the hole and how the trap works is the gopher is going to come in through here when he fills the hole back in and he's going to push this if you see that it's going to push this thing out of the way which holds this the wires back and it's gonna pop this one up pop this one up and then snap it back and it's gonna catch him in the little prongs back here and then he's gonna sit there and it's gonna kill him and then we're gonna pull him out and we'll put him back in the field and then we'll go to the next hole so we will put this in here put him nice nicely set in there and then we want to make it so it's all he's got to do is just barely hit it and then you can put a flag in it and to the next hole so, same day, Saturday, and we are on one of our neighbor's pieces, and we were hauling their hay. We just barely got done bailing that. As you can see, my dad's right there. He just started up, and he's going to get fuel. So I'm going to go over here, get in the cat loader, and I'm going to start stacking the bales. My dad just bailed three high, so me and my mom can tag team it and haul with two trucks and try to get it done by tonight because forecast says that it's supposed to rain tomorrow so we want to get stuff done hey everyone that's this week's video if you like it 
like below if you liked it enough subscribe questions put them in the comments um, as you if you follow me on Instagram you might notice that I'm actually not at our house we went on a vacation to Idaho and there's some pretty cool stuff that I showed on Instagram so go check it out at Nebraska Hay Farmer I had to think about that for a second have a great week thanks for watching